What's up guys, it's Smith here from GamersHeroes.com. We've got a quick guide for you today in Throne and Liberty on how to get to the Sorodoma Island fast travel waypoint so you can get back to the island much quicker. Now real quick, I did this video already, but someone pointed out that it's not available on all servers yet. I'm on an early access server, so I assume our milestones are ahead of someone else. This is the milestone your server needs to be on. You have to pretty much wait for these. You can complete the milestone yourself, but it doesn't transfer to the next level milestone until... The server is ready so it's a server based thing so if you haven't got it yet you haven't got it yet in order to get here all you have to do is ride the sky whale the gigantrite so you can check the schedule on your server to see when it spawns and when it does come in it will fly around half the map and eventually get to this area here at the observatory there are other places you can board it this for me is just the most familiar and i wanted to make sure i didn't mess it up so you can see here he's all the way up in the northwest he will fly a long way around it takes 15 minutes from the start of the event to Gigantrite reaching the observatory ruin. So about 15 minutes from start to get to where he needs to be mounted, which is about here. When he gets here, you can jump on board and fly around. Unfortunately, I've had several issues with this bloody Skywell lately. Falling off, falling through him, server crashing, all sorts of problems. So I wasn't able to get there this time, um, but I'm just showing you the route it sort of takes. It takes another 15 minutes from the observatory to get to the island. So the whole process, assuming you're not waiting too long at the observatory, is a minimum of 30 minutes for him to get there. Now, it's difficult to land if you don't know how to fly very well. You definitely should by this point, but if you can't, this is where I am. I'm right on the front sort of tusk of the creature here. Be careful using your map too much. I've tried this about five times, and three of the times I've fallen through the creature right after sitting in my map for too long. So I only flick it up very quickly. Sort of wait until you get relatively close. It's a very big island. It's this big one you can see sort of floating above the rest of the island. It is quite an easy target, to be totally honest. Now, there, obviously, there are issues with flying because of the lag. Sometimes it kind of you transform and then untransform and transform again. So, you know, be prepared to maybe be a bit frustrated. Again, be very, very careful if you are doing this at night. You'll see here just after I land, all of the people that have picked it up, the people that are landing early are just trying to kill other people from getting it because, you know, humans are horrible and would rather ruin someone else's day than make it. So just fly, you know, again, it's not, it's, it's a very big island. You're looking for that big purple beam down there. You can see it on the screen. Fly so your bird is almost directly above it sort of dip down a little bit you can once you've gone once you press down to fly straight down you can stop so fly straight down a little bit if you think you're going to miss it like i do here you're flying down you just wait a second go a bit more forward and then fly down again and then the rest will just take you down slowly so it's nice and quick nice and easy get when you get back to the game if we helped you out today do like subscribe we do appreciate it and i'll see you in the next one take care now